day of their lives and they don't want you to know that that's what they want you to do. They don't want you to know. So what do they do? They try to appear to be normal. Oh, I'm just reading the NIV. That's a good translation. Oh, I'm just reading the NKJV. That's a good translation. When actually what they're reading at home, what they're reading at church, what they're reading in their uh, really intensive Bible studies is their recovery version. Why would they do that? Because they know if you find out they have their own version of the Bible and it's full of witness Lee, you might look it up, you might Google it and find out that this, this group is a cult. They don't want that. So what they do with high school students, what they do with college students, what they do with new prospective members is they use deceptive, opaque, non-transparent methods such as these. They act as if uh, there's someone else. They put on a show. They're fake. They're phony. They don't really like the NIV. They don't really like the New King James Version the most. They like their version the most, but they won't tell you until they gain your trust. And then that's when they start giving you more and more of uh, what they really believe and who they really are. So again, this is not a very deep revelation or anything, but this is just a simple fact. And I'm going to be uh, doing more videos on some other things that these people are doing that is very deceptive. So uh, I hope this video was a blessing to you. I hope it exposed the obsequious behavior of this cult. God bless you.